That was weird, guys. I don't know if you saw, but she had something tucked between her legs and she was stood right by my car. So, I'm just going to wait and see. What was she doing? Time we on. I don't know if that's the right fucking time. We'll see what I'm going to see. I got some panniers the other day after making that video um, about uh, luggage and uh, I didn't know which luggage to get. I was having a look and kept my eyes open on eBay because I didn't want to spend a massive amount of money. But I managed to find um, some genuine KTM power parts um, panniers for the back with the bracket and paid 51 quid for them. So, bit of a bargain I think um, considering the brackets usually more than that I think on its own so I end up just getting these um, they seem to be alright they're not massively big um, but they fit my uh, fit my work bag and everything else in it so not too shabby really we are Saves me, saves me hanging a massive rucksack on the back um, every time I go out because I can just chuck these on or uh, I can chuck a bag on the back seat now and just bungee it to the to the bracket hanging underneath which is um, pretty good. I haven't, done a, I haven't done a video in a little while, um, just over a week or something I think, because of uh, I've been mad busy at work, basically. I had a load of days in work and then I only had a single rest day, one day off. By the time I'd slept and got everything sorted, there was no time to kind of make a video or edit them or stuff like that. So that's why you know, I haven't had a video up in about a week. Whoa, a fucking thing on my helmet keeps tapping against the side. Bloody annoying. Oh, I'm gonna pull in and sort that out because that's fucking doing my nutting. So I've managed to get my little brother. Um, interested and he's going to be doing his CBT in July so we're just keeping our eyes open at the moment for a, a little 125 for him something cheap and cheerful something good to learn on Since the, um, the, uh, the lockdown, well, not it's not been removed, but it's been eased or whatever you want to call it, there's been so many bikes out and about, isn't there? I've been literally everywhere I go, so I'm on the road quite a lot with my job, but I see, I see so many bikes. Oh, that helmet, the thing on my helmet's annoying it. I'm 
try and sort that out too. But I'm hoping that when doing it now, I've just tucked it under my chin, so I need to um, tie it up or something. It's a little bit of, uh, you know, you get that loose bit on the helmet where you cut the helmet together, you've got the loose bit to adjust it. It's just banged off the side of the helmet, but it's just like making a loud noise in my ear. Oh, I just cleaned my um, cleaned my helmet before I left the house. The boys on it because it was a state. I had like three million bugs on it. I've been out of the house ten minutes and now it's got like two million bugs on it again. I got a um, these these uh, the KTM panniers. They stick out slightly. I think they're just slightly wider than the handlebars. I have to try and keep that in mind when I've got them on because the last thing I want is a nightmare like that. Don't know if you could see them then. Just making sure the bad boys are still on there. <laughs> so I'll be just my luck to get to work and one of them's gone. Nice warm night though. Probably about a quarter past nine-ish, something like that but I can't feel the cold at all. Which is great. Let's go. Yeah, I did, uh, I have made a video, another one. I just haven't got round to editing it. Uh, yeah, because there was parts missing and it didn't really, uh, didn't really get together, so I was like, oh, didn't bother, because I was going to put that up halfway through this week, but then I realised there was parts missing and stuff like that, so I thought, what's the, um, what's the point? I just wait. Come on then, yes. Oh yeah. Next on my list it is an exhaust. That's what I need next. The thing is, they're not cheap though, are they? The old exhausts. Fucking always the way. As soon as you stop. Proper, um, proper nice day today. Not that I know what the day was like. I spent most of my day in bed. <coughs> the, um, Exhaust and this don't sound too bad when you give it give it some welly. But I just want it, I just wish it was a bit longer. Silly, silly. What a beautiful evening! see that we're allowed to go out uh, riding now and I haven't had any time off work since which is pretty depressing unlike old Straub's nose taking his bike from like Worcester to uh, um, London just an excuse to go out on his bike I love it
Yeah, guys, if um, if you've passed um, fairly recently, or um, recently got rid of a 125, and um, you swear by it, you think it's a decent 125, and it's not loads and loads of money, let me know in the comments below, so I can keep my eyes open for uh, one for my little brother. Don't really know what to um, what to look for. We're just looking at the moment, just a price range. But you know, some people are saying, "I'll oh, stay away from Lex Motos," and people say, "Oh, they're not that bad." And but they are usually the cheapest, um, the cheapest around. Obviously, they're probably the cheapest for a reason. But um, yeah, there's a few of them, a few of them going cheap. But I just uh, we don't know whether to take them or not. So yeah, I hope everyone's been well and uh, listening to the rules. <laughs> You're only allowed to ride with one other person from another household. I saw about eight bikes earlier all sat in the garage um, filling up with fuel and stuff like that and I thought surely seven of them don't live together. But I could be wrong and I probably was. <laughs> Uh, I want to know what proper time is because obviously it's got the time down there but that's been wrong since like the day after I bought the bike so I'm, a, I'm assuming that's a common another common problem with KTM or maybe they just these models of bikes but time always wrong considering it's linked to Bluetooth you'd think it'd be able to just pull pull the timer for the Bluetooth off my phone but never mind what can we do? Far from work now. Yeah, like I said, the um, most of the cheapest bikes are Lex Motos. So um, there's a few on there for fairly cheap. Seeing, um, I was looking for something like a YBR or something like that, that kind of style, but they they hold their money. Happy I've got the. Uh, Sort of the old service out. Decent amount of power now. I mean, it's not massively quick, 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 but there's enough there to have fun with. It's the part of the ride I hate because you get just hit with cross rings as soon as you come up here. It's nice going through all the. Um, like all the back roads, countryside, stuff like that. But go up to here, it's absolutely freezing and you've got ridiculous wind. Can't believe how like, warm it is tonight. It is pretty windy, but it's not actually cold. Which is uh, great news. I'm really at work now, I'm literally two minutes away. Which is, um, Amazing, but yeah, I'm gonna cut the video off here, guys. Um, but yeah, that was just a, just just a little commute to tell you why I haven't done a video in so long. Um, I have got stuff planned, exciting stuff. So you just have to uh, bear with me for a little while at the moment um, until I can get time off work and stuff like that. But we have got some exciting stuff planned. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please um, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. It really helps the channel out. Thanks, guys, and stay safe.